I hope you'll find a copy of this on a local bookshelf and follow along. The Squirrel Manifesto, a bushy tale for finding happiness, written by Rick Edelman and Jean Edelman, illustrated by Dave Zaboski. There is a forest not too far from here where the warm winds blow for most of the year. It's in this fine place you'll learn something good from some critters who live in the walkabout wood. It is a land alive with infinite hues, a symphony of colors in reds, yellows, and blues, where animals come and animals go with hardly a care for Michelangelo. From dawn to dusk and dusk to dawn, each awakens with joy and goes to sleep with a yawn. And while I may be small, perhaps you've heard, my name is Wren, and I'm your guide bird. I usually share in songs, not in words, every little thing in the language of birds. I know the secrets of every herd, hive, and clan. I watch with care as they work, live, and plan. The ants are fastidious, disciplined, and true. The beavers industrious, and the foxes shrewd. And of all the animals from the cliffs to the sea, there's one crazy bunch who knows how to be. Oh, they frolic and play and seem without a care, but they know a secret I'm emboldened to share. It is a singular truth I noticed from above how these creatures live with vision, charity, and love. I witnessed old Walden who lives in the big tree teach some young'uns how to gather and live free. Come with me, he cried, let's leap and let's scramble from tree limb to tree top and down to the bramble. And I'll teach you some things you'll always remember from season to season, September to September. To gather is great, a squirrel digs and he seeks, but don't hoard too much, it won't fit in your cheeks. This land is our home, these valleys and streams, we owe it our lives, our future, our dreams. Some of our boon goes back to the glade. So there's always a place for more young'uns to shade. We honor the past and what's been done and tend to the present for what it will become. Next, we take some nuts and we squirrel them away. So we have something for a cold rainy day. If we save just a little, a couple nuts at a time, it leads to what matters, squirrel, peace of mind. Next, we honor ourselves with the gains that we earn. We deserve a good life, so we enjoy our own turn. We put some of our flow back into the stream to add to the current and live what we dream. And lastly, I urge you to so others give back. It is hard in this forest for all those who lack. Your life is a blessing of gifts precious and rare. You multiply the grace when you care and you share. The old squirrel looked up and then he said, presto. We live by these words. It's the squirrel manifesto. Care for the world you live in and act. Save a little, spend a little, and always give back. Old Walden then granted that I share this with you. So when you gather your nuts, you'll know what to do. And if you ever forget, just look to the trees and remember the squirrels who live there with ease. <laughs>